you are able to import and export assets using Fixed Asset Manager. Assets can be imported into Fixed Asset Manager from the Pro Series Tax Program and from a CSV file. The import function is found under the File menu by going to File, Import, and then clicking on either Pro Series Tax or comma separated CSV. You can import from Pro Series from within a client file or from the client base. If an import is done from the client base, Fixed Asset Manager will create a new client and import the assets that are in the Pro Series file. Importing from a CSV file can only be done from within a Fixed Asset Manager client. The import wizard must be used to complete the import of a CSV file. The assets in a fixed asset manager client file can also be exported to Excel. To do this, you will first need to open a client file. Then go to File, Export Client, and click on Excel Spreadsheet. Remember, this can only be done from within a Fixed Asset Manager client file and only the columns in the current view will be exported to Excel. Assets in a Fixed Asset Manager client file can be exported into a Pro Series tax file as well. The Fixed Asset Manager and Pro Series must be the same year program in order to export the assets. It is a two-step process for the assets to appear in ProSeries. First, we'll export the assets from Fixed Asset Manager to an export file, and then we'll import the assets into ProSeries using that export file. Prior to the assets being exported to an export file, all assets must be linked to a tax form and property. The property name must be typed exactly as it is typed in the Pro Series return that the assets are being exported to. If the property name appears differently, Pro Series will create a new property with that name. There are two important caveats. The first is that if the asset is linked to the Schedule A, a property does not need to be entered for the asset to be exported. Secondly, the client type in Fixed Asset Manager must be the same as the type of return in Pro Series that the assets are being exported to. To export the client's assets, go to File, Export Client, Pro Series, and then click on Export. This will create the export file. Make note of where the export file is located on the PC. After the export file has been created, the exception report can be viewed for this export. If an asset has not been exported, the exception log will provide an explanation as to why the export of the asset has failed. This exception log will also contain other pertinent information. Please be aware that the ability to export to Pro Series will be grayed out when Pro Series of the same year is not installed on the computer. Pro Series and Fixed Asset Manager only work together if they are the same year programs. After viewing the exception log, open Pro Series and then open the client that the assets are to be imported into. Click on Import and then Fixed Asset Import. When the dialog box appears, browse and select the export file. ProSeries will then import the assets from the export file. If the assets are imported into the wrong client file within ProSeries, the Fixed Asset Manager import can be deleted from this client file. To do this, go to Import and click on Delete Fixed Asset Information. Remember, assets imported into a Pro Series client file will not transfer with the client file from year to year. In other words, the assets have to be re-imported each year after transferring the prior year Pro Series file to the current year Pro Series file. 
The reason for this is that the fixed asset manager data could potentially change and since Pro Series and fixed asset manager do not dynamically link, carrying the assets forward could result in inaccurate data. Clients with assets in Pro Series can be imported into Fixed Asset Manager and assets from a Pro Series client file can be imported into an existing Fixed Asset Manager client as well. Like exporting assets to Pro Series, both Pro Series and Fixed Asset Manager need to be the same year and the entity types must match. If there are any issues with the import, the information can be found on an exception log. To begin the import process, open Fixed Asset Manager and from the client base, click on File, Import, and then finally Pro Series Tax. The Import from Pro Series window will appear. Select the file or files to import into Fixed Asset Manager, then select Import. If the file is password protected, it will not appear in the Import From Pro Series window. To import assets from Pro Series into an existing Fixed Asset Manager client, first open the client. Go to File, Import, and click on Pro Series Tax. The window will only bring up the Pro Series clients that are the same entity type. Select a client and import. 